Hey, what's up guys? This is Spence, and on this video I'm going to show you guys how to get world edit and single player commands for Minecraft 1.6.2. Uh, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go into the download link that I have in the description, and it should bring you to a page like this with the uh, guys Minecraft guy and all that stuff. And you're going to want to go down here to the download manual installation because the automated has not come out yet. And you want to either go to the alternate or the preferred. Now the preferred is AdFly. The alternate is just a download link. I prefer to go to the preferred link to support the people who make the maps and the mods and the uh, you know the world edit and all that stuff. And you're gonna have to wait five seconds. Uh, all right, you have to wait five seconds. Sometimes you have to refresh it if it doesn't show an ad. But you have to wait five seconds and then you click uh, skip ad and then it should download down here. Now I've already put it on my folder here and actually already clicked it and made it into a folder so you're gonna wanna open that up I didn't make that one into a folder alright so you're gonna wanna open that one up and it's gonna have all this stuff in there and you'll really you're not gonna need the uh, the dot text so you can go on and, and delete those uh, so this is where some people mess up you have to go into your dot minecraft folder and on a Mac you actually have to go into your library and then application support and then Minecraft. Now on Windows you have to go to uh, I think you go to the start menu type percent app data percent and then the uh, I'm not really sure what the folder is called but uh, you go into the one folder that comes up and yeah then you go into dot Minecraft I think yeah it's dot Minecraft on Windows. Alright so you're gonna wanna go into your 1.6.2 or your, I mean your versions folder and you're gonna wanna right click 1.6.2 and on a Mac it's gonna be duplicate but on Windows you can just go to copy and paste but I prefer to do duplicate because it saves a little time so as you saw that I do it a minute ago I call mine world edit we and then that's uh, what I call it and don't forget once you go into the folder you have to rename uh, everything to the same name you also have to go into the JSON file and change that ID to world edit as well or WE or whatever you choose to name it. You can name it whatever you want to. And then you're gonna save it and then you're gonna be done with that. Alright, so this next part's a little bit different. You have to open it with a either WinRAR on Windows 7 or either uh, on Mac you can do ar archive utility or the unarchiver. I use the unarchiver because I like it better. I don't know why I just use it. Uh, takes a little bit longer on a Mac than I think it does on WinRAR, but it, it doesn't take that terribly long. It's pretty straightforward at this point. And you're going to want to go on and open up your single player commands folder that has all your uh, single player commands and go on and select everything but world edit. Don't want to update. All right. And then I'm just going to wait here for it to get done. And it should come back up in your uh, your versions folder where you had a uh, world edit. Alright, so that was taking too long, so I just went ahead and fast forward it. But uh, you're going to have your world edit folder right here. You're going to want to open that up, and then you're going to want to drag everything but world edit. Make sure you don't drag world edit in there because uh, you're going to need that for later. You can go on and drag world edit to your desktop if you want to. Uh, I'm gonna go in and apply to all and replace and you do the same thing on Windows computers um, that you do on here. So on a Mac you're gonna wanna click uh, kind and you wanna delete meta inf and then you're going to want to pick you're gonna wanna click one and you're gonna wanna go control A or command A on a Mac and then you want to compress all items after you compress them, it should be at the bottom, but sometimes people have trouble with that. So it doesn't. And then you want to go back in here and paste the item. Now make sure you pick everything, not the folder, like this. You don't want to click the folder and compress it. You want to go in there and uh, pick everything with Command A or Control A with Windows. And then you're going to have this archive. You're going to want to rename the archive to WE or whatever you named it and delete the jar and the folder. And then you're going to want to rename this dot .zip to dot .jar and use dot .jar. 
All right, so after you have that, you're going to have to go back into your Minecraft folder one more time and go to find it where it says bin. And then you want to open bin and then drag world edit in there. I already have it from the previous install, but I'll just replace it. And then you have world edit in your folder. All right, so to test it out, we're going to go into Minecraft and then you're going to want to go to profile editor select whatever profile you're using and then select whichever uh, whatever you named your uh, world edit. so it'll be release and then whatever you named uh, your world edit and single player commands now you don't have to do this unless you're installing forge with it on a Mac but uh, I'm not gonna be using that right now so I'll uncheck that alright so I'll do save profile and then I'll load it up to show you guys that it works all right, and then I'm going to go single player, single player commands test. And then it should come up and say single player commands right there uh, with the uh, with the little link there to show you the commands. Uh, and you can just slash slash wand, and then it's going to give you a wand, but I already have had a wand, so it doesn't really make that much of a difference. All right, guys, if you like the video, don't forget to hit that like button. Uh, Maybe subscribe if you want to or leave a comment to tell me what I need to do better on the next video. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching, and please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe.